Hey y'all, I'm back. It's the first Monday of 2013 and it's time for another mouth off moment. We're just going to jump right into it. First, let's get all the legalities out there. Subscribe, go ahead to One Chance TV, the number one chance TV on YouTube. Also, follow me on Twitter at Sandy J-P-O-C-E. Um, let's jump right into it. First, I would like to introduce you all. Um, I want you to embrace and accept my culture. I am of Asian descent, and I would love for you all to embrace who I am. I'm Asian. I'm disassociating myself with a particular culture. And after this mouth off moment, I think you'll understand why. But I, I just want you all to get to know me, my Asian side, and just be well. Yes. So let's jump right into it. We're going to start off with, I'm going to mouth off about the Real Housewives of Atlanta. And who's the star? Clearly, Miss Kenya Moore. We're going to discuss, just like I said on Twitter yesterday, look, no young-blooded, red-blooded American male will walk away from a butt-naked Kenya Moore. Hell, even some straight woman wouldn't walk away from a, a butt-naked Kenya Moore. So, Walter, have several seats. I, I want you to embrace whatever culture you you you're not trying to let us know about. Um, whatever. We'll just see how this season plays out with them. But I'm glad she got rid of him. All right, keep it pushing. Whatever. A mess. Um, let's jump into Love and Hip Hop New York. Wowzers. Great, great way to start off the first Monday of the New Year, Miss Mona Scott Young. Phew, let's just start with the good stuff. I'm interested in getting to know Rashida, her character, how she's going to play out. Um, Tahari, that's how you say it? I hope so. Tahari, um, she's very pretty. Crunk. Man, let's, let's talk about Tahari. Listen, girl. You ain't got to hide it, girl. You know you still feeling Joe. Um, and that's cool. Because he got you all, all just acting up. He know what strings to pull. So... You know how that works. Um, so, whatever. Tari and Joe. Them, those are the two to watch. I hope his new girlfriend. Listen, the new, the new girlfriend. I love this. She's just by the pool swimming like she ain't got no care. Look, she's like, look me in my face. I ain't got no worries. Listen, that mohawk was pow. pow, pow. She wasn't playing. She's just looking like, what them bitches doing? Uh oh, that's how I am. Oh, okay. He coming home with me. So she don't care. She, Honey, she better than me because I've been sipping a La Marita or a little cocktail from Seagram something or Moscato. Please. So she, she's, <laughs> please, do your thing, boo. What's her name? What's her name? Caitlin? Whatever. Look, she would have did what I was doing, but I would have had a cocktail in my hand. Um... So, what is it? Rashida, Tahari, and Joe. <sighs> Those are the people to watch. Rocky Boo, Rocky, Rocky Bobo, or whatever. Ma'am, listen. You want Joe, or you had Joe, and you sprung one or the other. You, you too emotional for me for not having to rid in that little light-skinned boy. So, get us together. You got you done got drinks tossed in your face. A, a Kool-Aid cup hits you by Tahari and, you know, all over. Girl. Oh, girl. Anyway, you better than me because the girl would have got drugged, but it's whatever. You, you missed your moment. So keep it pushing, boo. Um, Mendico, Medoso, Medusa, whatever his name is. I don't like him. I don't like his introduction this first episode. Maybe whatever. Um, yeah, sir, for you to say, we have to move out because I don't like my name not being on the list. Listen, sir, a woman will act up. It don't matter if it's her house, no house, whoever house, out house, back house. She will act up whoever name is on the the paperwork. You see Tahari throwing drinks at people in Joe's house. So what makes you think Yandy won't act up if your name on the lease or not? Please have several seats and just go somewhere else. <sighs> Anywho, Olivia, Rich, Erica, Olivia. So, 
so next black ink crew because i right now the olivia erica and rich gonna get me upset but whatever black ink crew let me explain this. y'all get puma off of my screen because i cannot you can't walk into your establishment or your job with one tooth missing sir oh, then now you're having a puma at caesar listen your shop is in harlem with the antics that you're allowing to go down at your shop, you, sir, you won't you won't be able to afford a shop in and one of them boroughs in New York. So get it together, okay? That Alex, she, you should have drug her up and down the shop and kick. Uh, the first time you fired at her, the fired her not a word. The first time you fired her should have been it. You can't come back late if you're fired. Tuh. So keep playing with Alex all you want to. She would have got drugged. I could I understand some I understand Caesar's position sometimes and I know how it feels, but sir, you gotta buckle up. You you paying Harlem rent. You're not paying Wichita, Wisconsin rent. You're paying Harlem rent for that space. So get it together, sir. Mixie Pixie girls, fairy odd parents. I don't know who the mixie things are, what they are and who they are. But, honey, that little fake fight with the Duchess and the Mixie chick, please, ch Chabu, go somewhere else. Because you will not. I would have drug her, too. Anywho, I will be tuned in to Black Ink Crew. But y'all need Tabitha's makeover, takeover, whatever she want to call it. And Ayana Bandant to fix your life, take your life, do something. Because y'all out of control. Period. You wonder why I'm embracing my Asian, my Asian culture for 2013 because it is nonsense that's going on. Anywho, I think that's it for me. I'm going to go watch another show on MTV and I'm going to do a little video about that. But, you know, once again, subscribe to One Chance TV on YouTube, the number one chance TV. Follow me on Twitter, at Sandy, J-P-O-C-E, and... Rock out for 2013. Alrighty, guys. Bye. This has been another edition of Mouth Off Moments.